Hi, I'm Lee Roberts, combat designer on Dead to Rights Retribution. The main feature of our combat system is to give players the choice of hand-to-hand, ranged and the use of shadow to tackle any situation. In this section I'm going to shoot the enemy on the left and send shadow in to take out the guard on the right. In this room there's a lot of enemies so it's best to go into cover first. We can shoot the gas canister here to take out the gun emplacement. Dead to Rights features a 360 degree fighting system which means enemies can attack from all sides. The player can counter this by throwing punches and kicks in any direction. In a tight situation you can also clinch an enemy and throw him to create space. You can also use the disarm feature to take the enemy's weapon away from them and use it against them. But this works both ways with the enemy being able to disarm the player. From clinch, the player can also take the enemy hostage. But while in hostage, the enemy acts as a piece of mobile cover. Sometimes the enemy will struggle, so I have to hit him to bring him back under control. Or I can kick him into the other enemies around me. You can also activate focus mode to give me more time to pick my shot. You can combine these actions, so here I'm going to take a hostage, activate focus mode, and I'm also going to take his gun off him and use it against the guard in front of me. Then finally, send Shadow to take out the last guard who's in cover. I no longer need the hostage, so I'll kick him away and shoot him while he's down. You'll need to use all these skills when you enter an open combat situation like this. Firstly I send Shadow down to disrupt the enemy, then I use my gun to take down the sniper. Once that threat's been taken care of, I lay some suppressing fire down. Then I'll break cover so I can engage the enemies at close quarters. Here I'm going to face a much tougher enemy, so I've activated focus mode, I'm going to hit him with my rifle, and then I'm going to follow this up with a very quick combination attack. By doing this it gives me the option to use a takedown move. There's a different takedown for each weapon, as well as some for hand-to-hand. -hand. The combat in Dead to Rights is a mixture of strategy, player choice, and seamlessly combining the core game mechanics to make a different playing experience every time.